reported Alex Jones ruling to pay $965 million, almost a billion dollars. We're going to talk about that on the show next. Welcome to the Matt Logan Show. Opinions are flying about Alex Jones and the billion-dollar payout for the, the, quote, hoax claims. Conspiracy theorist. Yep. So my th- thoughts, opinion, um, really roughly here at the beginning is, is uh, I think, I, okay, let me, let me back up a second. That screenshot that I sent you? Mm-hmm. Of Elon Musk, yeah. did you look it over or not? No. Okay. I, I read it, but okay. I don't know if I, am I missing it's, something? Yes, and that's why I sent it, and I was going to see if I, I wanted to remember to ask you right away. So um, go ahead. I'll talk about it while you open it. Yeah. <laughs> so if if so, Elon Musk says that he intends a, it's a tweet, a screenshot of a tweet um, that he intends to pay. Um, you know, for Alex Jones's um, ruling, you know, he said something like he intends to pay whatever for Alex Jones in that. Yep, you want uh, me to read Austin. it? Yeah, go ahead, read it. From Elon Musk, I intend to pay Alex Jones's legal damages. What is the point of wealth if you don't fight for your values? Austin is going to be the new home for free speech. Okay, so look below that at the date. That's what I was wondering if you would catch. October 12, 23. <laughs> <laughs> so they put in a little nugget in there to, yep. for people to see that it would be fake. Throw you off, yep. Um, but here's here's what it is um, for funny. me in, that, in a lot of the things that I went through and saw. First off, Alex Jones for years has apologized for it in that, you know, something about... I'm not defending Alex Jones at all, but um, you know this has been going on for ten years or whatever ish, mm-hmm. and uh, he has apologized multiple times that he got that one wrong, and you know his information and, and everything else. What I will say about Alex Jones that I've noticed over years is he gets a lot right. I mean, he he blew the top off of Bohemian Grove. Mm-hmm. Go look that up if uh, if you don't know anything about it. And I'm Is not going to place in California. Yes. Yep. Um, and so he and, and many other things that for for a long time he was talking about in this you know as he is called a right wing conspiracy theorist. I don't know why right wing is the thing because he he. He's called tons of Republicans in the quote right side, but right. Why is he called a right wing? I don't know. Conspiracy theorist, okay, for sure. I mean, but what does that even mean? That was a that was a term coined by the CIA to make people look the other way. Right. So let's just go with that. But anyway, <laughs> he is he's called it uh, on a lot of things. He's got a lot of things very right or very close to right. Correct not right as in the right side of the aisle. And so to me, what this does is a few things. This is a, this is a first amendment issue. And 100%. And so therefore um, you have to go in there and prove defamation in order for there to be any kind of lawsuit. So how did he defame those people? Did he call out anybody by name? Not that I saw or found. That's kind of what he, I He said the parents and the relatives well. and, and stuff, but no mm-hmm. one specific that I saw. Right. I'm not defending him. N- no. Let me make that clear. I don't know enough about it to say yeah. he's guilty or he's not guilty. Right. And if you're going to make a comment like that, just like anything else, you better have some kind of proof or evidence to kind of back up your claim. Then again, was his show, and there's a means to an end on this comment, Yeah, was his show news or entertainment? Entertainment. Because I think most of our mainstream media 
is not news anymore. It's no. all entertainment. Yeah. And he is he would be labeled as an entertainer right. an entertainment show. It's not no one would it's ever label it as a newscast. Right. So if it's gonna, interesting. Yeah, and if you're going to hold him responsible for his entertainment opinions, you better start holding mainstream media responsible for their entertainment opinions that are not called entertainment opinions. Right. That are called facts. Right. Watch the nighttime that, news. Yeah. And right. so it's a very, very dangerous place to be, if you ask me. They're um, setting a heck of a precedence. Yeah. Yeah. So, And there's no way that they're going to be able to squeeze a billion dollars out of them anyway. No. doesn't have a billion dollars. No. He never did. No. Exactly. Yeah. So, so it's, it's, it's all weird. Yeah. It, it, look. The Sandy Hook families, I, I know you'll never listen to this podcast. I, I get that. But I am sincerely sorry for your loss. It's mm -hmm. terrible. Um, I think that people should not, A, make fun of it. And I don't think people should make stuff up about it for entertainment value either. No, it's uh, or, or very any of those. It's a horrible thing. So I, I do believe, though... Um, because of the tragedy that I went through and, and how attorneys and, and all these other people and what they have approached me with and Sue and this blah, 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 all that crap. Um, be careful where you spend your energy. Be very careful where you spend your energy in, in something mm -hmm. like this. And um, I don't think this is energy well spent, in my opinion. Um, I think that this gives, frankly, this is going to have me pay attention to Alex Jones a little bit more. Not to the Sandy Hook thing, but to Alex Jones. That's what this energy did to me. Good, bad, or in between. That's not, but this shows maybe I should look at Alex Jones and watch more of what, what he does and says. Um, so, I, my opinion. And when it comes down to it, the litigation or the money is not going to bring your kids back. No. And I think that's kind of where you've come from is it's not what you want. You want teach back. Yeah. And that can't it happen. can't happen. So, so what's the next best thing? Exactly. In my opinion, do what I'm doing. Right. Hey, did you see that video? Did I send it to you? Narrow that down. <laughs> <laughs> Good point. Um. Where I was out of school speaking. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So that's that's my why. Mm -hmm. I think that's where my energy is best spent right. for the keep, future. If you can keep another student from person having the same fate. Person, yeah. Yeah. So um, yeah, and I'm giving that thought and opinion and, and, and even advice in where to spend your energy from experience. Mm -hmm. Not a specific experience that Sandy Hook did, but certainly uh, losing a child experience right. point of view. Right. So. Part of a club that nobody wants to be a member of. No. 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 So, yeah. yeah. It'll be interesting to see where this goes just because of um, the precedents that they've set. Yeah. And um, if if you're going to hold him accountable for what he said, like we talked about, you better start looking at everybody else too. Yeah, yeah, because this really um, is minuscule in comparison to the true damage that has been done in media uh, that call themselves news um, over the last ten years since Agreed. this has happened. So Agreed. This and, is, and the fact that he didn't continue to tell that. He right. apologized, and he didn't ever say it again. Yeah. Unlike what's happening with a lot of our other media. Yeah, exactly. Who continue to hound on the same things over and over and over. Yep. They, they are telling the lie until it becomes the truth. And I, I don't mean the lie, and I'm not saying it, a specific lie in that comment. I'm saying it happens all the time. Mm -hmm. So I've been affected by that myself, and it's yeah. yeah, yeah, it's infuriating. It's frustrating. 
how do you sue somebody for defamation of character? It's really difficult. It. Yeah. yeah, it's really, really, really difficult. So, and and I don't know um, what the damages are going to do. Do they have intentions of taking? You know, my everything I've seen and read about it. My opinion would be all they're trying to do is ruin Alex Jones. Mm -hmm. Okay, well that's vengeance. It still doesn't bring your child back. It doesn't, and so. I guess to me is the money that's being spent on trying to ruin Alex Jones is money being spent, could be spent somewhere else that's helping to save life instead of ruin Alex Jones. Do you know who wins in this? The lawyers. Oh, and that's it. Precisely. It's the only person, it's the only group that wins out of this. Yep. Like you said, that money could be used for so many better things. Yep. Yeah. Uh, School security would be a start. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Matt at Matt Logan Speaks is my email. We'll see you next time.